Hello and welcome to the South West Catchments Council annual report for 2013-14. This year we're delivering an online interactive annual report which we hope will provide you with a richer experience and more information in relation to the programs and projects that we deliver. Once again, 2013-14 has been a year of change and adaptation in the NRM sector. Even with this uncertainty though, SWIC continues to deliver strong projects and regional support to the many and varied groups that deliver NRM outcomes for the South West community. Some of the highlight projects that we commenced this year include the VAS Wannerup investigation node that will see three PhD candidates providing key management recommendations for the VAS Wannerup wetlands. The commencement of the Ocean Depression Regional Park project in partnership with the City of Bunbury. Through this project, the biodiversity values will be enhanced and the broader community engaged to protect and enjoy this important community asset. The Home River Ocean Save the Crabs campaign was once again encouraging urban residents to hold off on the fertiliser till spring to reduce the nutrient runoff in our rivers and estuaries. Across our agricultural program, 31 trials and demonstration sites were established throughout the southwest to test and showcase sustainable practices. The agtrialsites.com website was also established to ensure this information is widely available to farmers and agronomists across the region. Our inland linkages and iconic species projects have seen further biodiversity outcomes delivered in the east of our region and for the endangered hairy marron and Bolston's pygmy perch. Partnerships are a key part of the way SWIC does business. In total, more than 30 community-based groups partnered with SWIC in the 13-14 financial year to deliver our programs and 67 organisations were supported by SWIC. This includes a very important partnership with Western Dairy for the delivery of the Dairy Industry Development Specialist role, hosted by SWIC. In the coming year, SWIC will be transitioning to the National Landcare Program, which is based on the premise of local, simple and long term. This will see some changes in the region with adjustments to our current programs, staffing levels and the reintroduction of the Community Devolved Grant Scheme. The design of the NLP is ideal for the South West region, although the constrained budget and the lack of competitive funding available will be a challenge for many groups in the South West, including SWIC. As such, alternate business development will be a focus and SWIC will be looking for opportunities within the Green Army, 20 Million Trees, State NRM programs and many others. SWIC is continually improving its governance and community engagement, with increased participation and transparency through the regional coordination team meetings increased membership of the SWIC Association and more opportunities for engagement in our projects. The development of a new corporate strategic plan for 2015-18 will be a joint priority for the Board and Management in early 2015. Thank you for your interest in, our, in SWIC and we hope you enjoy our annual report.